Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and it's November. Yep, it is November. And so that means we're doing a massive giveaway. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for being here. It's November. Yes, it's November. I can't believe, halfway through. Halfway through November, that means Christmas is right around the corner and you don't want to miss any of the Christmas giveaways. Doing at least five, five at least five that I know of, right? And uh, you don't want to miss out on them because they're going to be massive. They're going to be huge. So mash like, mash subscribe, mash follow, push those buttons. You don't want to miss out. And uh, giving away just an insane amount of money worth of magic. And how can I do this? How can I, how can I, I you, you, know, you know how I can do this? Because I am blessed. I am lucky. I am very lucky that magic houses and magicians send me product for free so that I can review them, but I don't keep it. I don't keep this stuff. I turn around and I send it right back out to y'all so that you can become even better magicians. So today, doing a giveaway, I was trying to find a theme right? Find a theme for Thanksgiving. Here in the States, here in the States, we celebrate Thanksgiving. It's a season of thankfulness and delicious food. So we're doing a food giveaway. That's right. We're doing a food giveaway. Now, don't worry. Nothing in this box is perishable. It doesn't have to be overnighted to you. Nothing's going to melt. But food related, food adjacent, food akin. Akin? Yeah. Tricks. So I found all the tricks that were food related and put them all into a box for you. Over $200. Over $200 worth of magic this November. Let's look in the box. First up, we got Gum and Get Some by Amanda Nepo. This was a $40 value. An empty pack of gum becomes a full pack of gum in the blink of an eye. Then you got Sugar from Magic Dream Paris. This was also $40. And with this one, you can transform a card into a sugar packet and in reverse. Next up, we got Invisible Cocktail. This was from Wayne Dobson and Alan Wong. This was a $15 value with absolutely no funny business, no mnemonics, no arithmetic, no fishing, no questioning. You, the magician, will immediately be able to name a cocktail your spectator is merely thinking of. Next up, we got Sweet Disposition by Luke Osland and Aussie fans. This is a $20 value. Sweet Disposition is a surreal transformation effect that looks exactly like computer graphics because a pile of loose sugar will become a cube in the palm of your hand. Then we got Kung Food by Bizarro, $15. If you're familiar with Karate Coin, this is Karate Coin, but done with an Oreo cookie. Then we got Candy Ghosts by Andrew and Andre. This is a $25 value. This is a card reveal in a tic-tac box. So let's say you force the five of hearts. You will be able to reveal it inside the uh, tic-tac box with your breath. You just breathe on it and the fog will create the five of hearts. Then we got Taste It from Magic Dream. This is a $35 value. This is a whole mentalist routine with colors and taste and tic-tacs. Another Tic Tac trick and another trick from Magic Dream Paris. Then we got Instant Tea by the French Twins and Magic Dream. This is a $40 value. This is an incredible visual, unexpected transformation of a card and it turns into a tea bag, but there's more. Not only can you transform the card into a tea bag, but you can also make anything appear within the tea bag. This is an incredible trick, a lot to do with this. And I'll even throw in a deck of cards. I'm going to give you the snail deck. Why, why, why the snail? Because you can eat snails, right? It's escargot. I was trying to find a deck of cards that would work for food. This was the closest one I could find. Okay. This is, so regardless of how you feel about snails, <laughs> some people do eat them. So, and the trick right before this was from the French twins and French people eat snails. See the correlation? See how that fit? See, I tied... I tied those two things together. See, just like that. So throwing in a deck of cards there for you as well. $230. This box that I will mail to someone, some one lucky person, $230. And you want to get it in by the deadline, which is November 19th. November 19th is the deadline. That is the last day that I will accept any submissions. And I will not reveal a winner before 
November 19th. So if you are notified by a robot that looks like me, guess what? It's not me. I don't ever pick winners before the deadline. So don't be fooled. Just report those, report those to YouTube and move on with your day. I will, I will notify the winner in person. Okay. So don't worry. It, it won't be some, some spammy spam bot. So how do you enter? How do you win? How do you, how do you enter this contest? Uh, I just need one submission from you, one, one entry, and it's going to be in the form of a comment down below. Let me tell you what the comment is because this is food, right? And usually things are put together with ingredients. There's a recipe. You take two things or more and combine them to make a new thing, right? I want you to take the titles of the tricks that are in this giveaway. And I want you to make a new trick. So how could you combine two of those titles up there or three, right? And create a new trick. Now the trick doesn't have to have a premise or a plot or anything. I just want you to take those words and make something new. For instance, Kung Fu from Bizarro, Kung Fu, that was one of the trick titles, right? And Gum and Get Some was another one of the titles. You could take those two titles and you could make Kung and Get Some, right? You could. You could make Kung and Get Some. So, and, and again, it's just for fun. It's just for fun. All I want you to do is take two of the titles in the giveaway and do a mashup and make a new trick, make a new title. Doesn't need a plot, doesn't need a theme, doesn't need any other, doesn't need any explanation. <laughs> just create your own funny trick title using the, the tricks that are in the giveaway. I hope that wasn't confusing. If you're, if you're still confused, look at some of the comments that people have already left and uh, gain inspiration. I'm sure there's hundreds of different combinations. Like I said, you can use two, you can use three, you can use four. You can use any combination of titles you like. I hope that's not too weird. I hope that's not too weird. But that's my, that's my November getaway, giveaway. Get it all in by November 19th. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, would you like to learn a magic trick? You would. Did you know I have a second channel? That's right. I have a second channel where I teach beginning level magic tricks. Magic Channel Card Tricks is a place that you can go to to learn tricks with ordinary items you can find around the house. Paper clips, rubber bands, pens, and of course, decks of cards. I teach beginning level card tricks, simple card tricks, simple card forces that anybody could learn. I also review magic kits. So if you go buy a magic kit from the store, uh, your local Walmart or Target, uh, or you get a magic kit for Christmas, I'll go over exactly what's inside. And I'll even teach you how to perform with some of those tricks that you get inside those kits. Plus, I'm even gonna give you video instruction to very simple, very inexpensive tricks that you can pick up at your favorite magic store. Sometimes you get those tricks and the instructions are just on a tiny little piece of typewritten paper and you have no idea how to do that trick. Don't throw that trick away. Don't put it in a box. Come back to Magic Channel Card Tricks and I will teach you how to use that trick as well. Or maybe you're not a beginner. Maybe you're not a beginner, but maybe you have a niece or a nephew or a little brother or sister that is, that you could share this channel with them. This is a great, safe place, kid-friendly, where they can learn beginning level magic. Make sure you head on over to Magic Channel Card Tricks. Give my videos a like. Subscribe to that channel. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for being a part of Magic Orthodoxy.